All right, good morning, good evening, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, sisters of YouTube. This is Pastor Dow. Um, Sister Carol and I are in town for the day, and, and I, I can't tell you the last time I've actually been in a mall. This is Rivergate Mall in Madison, Tennessee. And, um, and I noticed before going into here that it says, pursuant to Tennessee Code uh, 3917 1359, the owner and operator of this property has banned weapons on this property or within this building or this portion of this building. Failure to comply with this uh, prohibition uh, is punishable as a crime under the state law and may be subject and may subject the violator to a fine of not more than $500. $500. So, you, this, you know, Rivergate Mall and places that have signs up like this don't ever have to worry about me coming into this place and giving any money to any of these stores, any of these institutions. And I would also say to you out there, if you go to any store, any building, and you can't exercise your right, your liberty, to be able to carry and defend and protect yourself, then you don't need to give these businesses, nor none of these places, any of your attention, nor money. So Rivergate Mall, I haven't been here in probably five years, ten years, something like that. So they got to never worry about me again for the rest of my life. And that's the attitude I think you ought to take. Now, with that said, those of you who follow me, uh, as I follow the Messiah, you may want to get on the online church, www.online-church.org tonight, because I'm going to talk about the character of Israel, the way we should be behaving. I'm going to use an example that was presented to me uh, last night as well as this morning. And I'm going to show you how the enemy comes in and starts tearing up blocks and starts bringing division amongst people. But I have to use the example of these text messages that were sent to me. Now, I'm not shooting at anyone, but I do need to bring this out and use this example so that people will be able to understand how they need to behave whenever we're in the house of Yah. We need understanding how we live here. And there's a difference between us and them. There's a difference between us and them. And you may want to listen to this tonight because I want to show you how the enemy causes one offense and uses one offense that is concocted in the spirit of people's minds to cause them to be divisive, divisive and divided amongst Israel. And for anyone to actually think that they are above these circumstances, maybe you ought to come in and, and, and tune in tonight and really truly listen because we hope that this will bring some edification, some exhortation, some comfort so you can hear what a real pastor talks and what a real pastor teaches as far as us being holy and being set apart and being mature believers. I hope that I, that, you know, I see you tonight. Don't go into this place. We're getting ready to leave right now. Shalom.